Hey guys, um, welcome back to another episode of the cryptocurrency event. Um, so this will be a four part vlog. This is vlog three in the series. This will be a four part vlog. Part one was my journey up here and how excited and all that sort of stuff. Part two, I want to talk a little bit about the two companies that were instrumental in arranging this event. Okay. Um, part three, I want to talk a little bit about the speakers that were, are going to be at the event. And then part four will be the event itself. So that's something to look forward to. I'm going to try and live stream when I can. Um, so yeah, like look out for that. If you want to follow any of that crypto genius learning on Facebook, um, and yeah, you can find me on Twitter as well under the same name. So anyway, so there's two, two companies that have been instrumental in organizing this event. Okay. They work together. The one is a parent company of the other one. Um, but the first one is blink. Okay. Blinktech.io. I'll drop the link down below so you guys can find them online and who they are and what they are is an emerging technology specialist. Okay, blockchain is emerging technology. So Blink helps facilitate co collaboration, connections and innovations within South Africa, the South African emerging technology industry. Okay, so a little bit about Blink, right? So they, they were here to try and provide education. Okay, and we'll talk a little bit about that now. But that to me is the most important aspect of why I'm doing these videos is education. Not only educating myself, but trying to help educate other people on blockchain. Okay. Um, a lot of people know about Bitcoin um, and they've heard about other currencies, cryptocurrencies. And yes, the word is getting spread further and further. But a lot of people are, they only see a price. Um, I've had my uncle turn around to me and said, oh, if you didn't invest in the beginning, it's too late now. It's too late. Dude, this train hasn't even started. People that are involved now are early adopters. Don't let anyone fool you. You are early adopters. But as I mentioned in previous videos, if, if we didn't go through this bear cycle, okay, Oh, uh, and that just went from 20,000 to 50,000 to a hundred thousand, whatever the case might've been, I wouldn't have learned anything. Okay. Would I take that time back? No. Yes. My, 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 my pockets, my piggy bank doesn't quite have the same <laughs> figure that it had before, but I will never take that back. I haven't sold anything. So it's still valid. It's still there. I, my coins are there. Um, when it's, this year was instrumental because it taught me to go and educate myself further on what the technology is. Stop caring about the price. I, I can't even remember when last I looked at my portfolio. And that's, that is the idea. Like it's that you, you need to learn about the technology. So that's what Blink does. Okay. They offer um, in-class training. Okay, they offer online training and they also offer webinars. So if you want to learn more about blockchain, this is the company that in South Africa, especially in South Africa, they are the company that are innovating in that industry of teaching people more about blockchain. Okay, and um, they do courses that range from blockchain for beginners to blockchain for your business. Okay, at your request, you can also um, get a specific training content for yourself and um, uh, such content such as like cryptocurrency mining, etc, etc. Their trainers are available to provide um, specialized training for your company offices um, or they can arrange for a fully facilitated custom course at one of their training locations. Um, they are based up in Joburg and one in Cape Town. So they are around, okay, but they also do online training. Um, so even if you're staying in the sticks and you want to learn more and you don't have time to go to 
um, their, their offices and learn something there. Do an online course. Um, so another o o thing that they offer is consulting. Okay. Uh, Blink's team of highly experienced directors would love to assist um, with your company's blockchain journey. Blink has a diverse team which provides our, their clients with the benefit of a broader range of advice, um, whether it's identifying and developing a block, blockchain strategy or to discuss a potential of a concept you would like to explore. Okay. Now, I have an idea. Um, I have a very good idea. Um, I know something like this hasn't been done yet, but I want to network first. I want to meet these guys. I want to see what they're all about. That's why I'm so excited to be coming to this conference, okay? Um, because to be able to be involved with people that are in the industry is going to be so much more, be more beneficial for my knowledge and growth in this um, revolution. Um, okay, so then the other thing they offer um, is obviously Blockchain Entrepreneurs Club South Africa. Okay, so this is a dedicated to blockchain education, growing the eco an ecosystem of entrepreneurs. That's why I like them. I want to be an entrepreneur. I, a lot of people already call me an entrepreneur. Um, yes, but the wikipedia definition i am an entrepreneur um so they this ecosystem of entrepreneurs creating opportunities and encouraging social responsibility in south africa um, B -E -C -A -S -A, um plan to achieve this by making key strategic partnerships and holding networking events to promote this in the blockchain community okay so that is how I found them. Um, yes, we've had a bit of a dis. When I first was introduced to them, I went on a little bit of a rant, I must admit, because of the fact that a friend of mine from the UK showed me them on Twitter. Okay. Um, and I was, I, I was, I saw that they were holding an event and I was just like, guys, where's your marketing? Like, I had to get a friend from the UK to tell me you guys are around and you guys are holding events here. Like, you guys should do some marketing. And I understand their theory on they want to do it organically and they grow slowly, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, and they didn't want to come across as spammy. And in this space, if you over market yourself, then you could come across as spammy. But I don't want them to sell anything apart from maybe training courses. But even then, I was just saying to them that it's not about selling anything. In my in my eyes, it's not about selling anything. It's about educating more people on blockchain. And this is what they're doing. Okay. I, I, I jumped the gun slightly when I did um, go on my rant. And I do apologize to them. Um, blockchain Entrepreneurs Club South Africa, I do apologize for that. I'm just very passionate about the things I do. And this is one of the things I'm doing. So when I saw this, uh, I wanted to be a part of it, but I was also pissed off because how did I not know about this before? And so cut a long story short, I'm now coming to one of the events and I'm looking so forward to it. The event's called chain reaction, as I've mentioned in part one of this vlog. Um, and yeah, it's, I'm really looking forward to it. There's going to be some really good speakers there, um, which I will talk about in part three of this vlog. So now if we just talk a little about a bit about Blockchain Entrepreneurs Club South Africa, the four pillars of BECSA is education. Obviously, we've discussed this already. Um, they encourage and facilitate learning in the pursuit of growth in the South African blockchain industry. Okay, networking, encouraging collaboration and networking in order to foster sharing and inclusion in South Africa. Okay, so this is what not only this event's about is education, but it's also about networking. Then they do entrepreneurship, uh, BECSA, strive to provide support system for the creation and execution of business ideas and innovation. 
okay so this is another reason why i like them because i have an idea and they potentially could help me but i want to learn more about them first okay uh, and then social responsibility um BECSA in partnership with the Festive Collective, Collective aims to encourage social responsibility in the blockchain space. Okay, so a little bit about Blockchain Entrepreneurs Club South Africa. Um, formed in March 2018. Okay, so they haven't been around that long, um, but they are doing their bit, and that's all that counts. Um, I've been in crypto a bit longer than that, a couple, uh, six, seven months, no, six months before that. Um, so I haven't been in crypto that long. And for me to have had that rant with them was probably uncalled for. So as I do, as I said before, I do apologize for that, guys. So the Blockchain Entrepreneurs Club serves as a destination for those interested in learning about all things blockchain related from DLTs to Hyperledger, to cryptocurrency, okay? This is a space for individuals from different backgrounds who would like to learn about blockchain and be part of the growing, part of growing the South African blockchain industry. Meetups will be organized in different cities where you can meet, network, and share business ideas with like-minded individuals and entrepreneurs. It's always good to network with people with the same frame of mind as yourself. So that's why I'm looking forward to this, especially looking forward to this, to be honest. Um, and yes, they are doing their bit. They, like th these two companies, well, these two organizations that are working together, the one's parent company for the other, um, they have their roles. And I appreciate what they are doing because A, they have organized more cryptocurrency events and B, the speakers at this event are all prominent South African cryptocurrency innovators, okay? And to be able to hear what they saying about this space would, it's just going to be mind-blowing, to be honest. Um, I cannot wait. Um, I even came up on Thursday, the event's only on Monday. Um, and yeah, I, like I booked my, ticket before I even I mean I booked my plane ticket before I even knew the price of the actual event so I was a little bit worried when um one of my uh, friends uh, Herbal Earl turned around and said um you can fi find him on Twitter um said oh it's just I wonder what the price of the tickets would be because sometimes these things can go for like two three thousand rand I was like oh no <laughs> I hope not but yes very reasonably priced 125 rand for early birds 150 rand for the early bird ticket sales were sold out in the first day so you can see the response to this um i don't know what their previous events were like but i can only imagine that they are going to start getting better um as you know in the past in my previous two vlogs i've titled them trying to organize a cryptocurrency event in south africa um I've already spoken to a few companies, a Chinese company, a, a content creation company, a couple of YouTubers, and they are all interested in um, getting more information about coming to South Africa to talk about blockchain technology. So if somewhere along the line, instead of me trying to organize an event, can we not like, can I not try and collaborate with them? for future events or something like that. You know what I mean? Um, that is one of the reasons why I'm coming up and seeing what it's all about, seeing what they're all about. Um, Cause I know what my drive is and I know my passion and I know all that sort of stuff. And I know how determined I am to do things I set my mind to. So I just want to see what their part is. And um, the fact that they've got Luno coming to the table, Monero coming to the table, Civic, uh, key coming to the table so obviously it's Vinny it's uh, Ricardo and it's uh, Marius um, that's they've done a really awesome job so I'm not complaining at all I'm looking so forward to it so yes in part three I'm going to be talking a little bit more about the actual um, speakers that will be at the event so if you want to follow and get more content on that please subscribe to the channel like the video um, and then yes we can go from there anyway guys 
See you in part three of the cryptocurrency event. Take care.